Hi friends, in this video, we will learn about smart vision. As you can see, there are four cases for which we can program Robby or Bonnie. As you can see that in your Robby or Bonnie, you have two IR sensors. This is the right sensor. This is the left sensor. Now we will learn how to program these sensors. As you can see, there are four cases. Both sensors, when both the sensors detect an object. No sensor when no object is detected by any of the sensors. Right sensor is for when only the right sensor detects an object. Left sensor is only for when the left sensor detects an object. Now let us start. When programming for both sensors, Robby will do the following functions. When both sensors detect an obstacle, it will either go forward, backward, take a right turn, take a left turn or stop. For Bonnie to be an object follower, we want to go forward. So we will select go forward and then press OK. So now let us program it for no sensors. This case will be true if nothing is detected by any of the sensors. For our Bonnie to be an object follower, we would like our Bonnie to stop when Bonnie detects nothing. You can see stop is already selected. Now for the third case, the right sensor. This case will be true when the right sensor detects an obstacle. We would want our Bonnie to turn right when a right sensor detects an obstacle. Then the fourth and the last case for the left sensor. This case will be true when the left sensor detects an obstacle. For a Bonnie to be an obstacle follower, we would want Bonnie to turn left when it detects an obstacle. And now let us see how does it work. All I have to do is press start and our Bonnie will start working as an object follower. I am going to use this piece of paper as an object which our Bonnie will follow. So now let us click on start. As you can see Bonnie is now following this piece of paper. So we just saw how Bonnie works as an object follower. Wow, isn't that fun? Now we will program Bonnie to work as an obstacle avoider. For Bonnie to work as an obstacle avoider, we will have to program two cases primarily for both sensors and for no sensors. Both right sensors and left sensors will be on stop. As you can see, right sensor and left sensor are on stop. I would want Bonnie to go backward when both sensors detect an obstacle. I would want Bonnie to go forward when none of the sensors detects an obstacle. As you can see, Bonnie is moving forward because none of the sensors is detecting an obstacle. As I place an obstacle, which is this piece of paper in front of Bonnie, it is going backwards. Wow, isn't that cool? 